Musicians are notoriously difficult to shop for. If you get them something that they'll love and use, the feeling that you're going to get from giving it to them will definitely make that effort worthwhile. But there is absolutely no reason why you should struggle to find the perfect gift for the musician on your list, because I've already done all that legwork for you and compiled a list of guaranteed home runs. Welcome to the Gear Gods Holiday Gift Guide. What's up, Gear Mortals? Trey Xavier here. Like I said, this is the Gear Gods Holiday Gift Guide for Musicians, in which I try to help you find the perfect gift for your musician friends. Everything that I'm gonna talk about today has a link in the description below. That's right there down under the video, where you can buy each of these things and have it shipped immediately to who will very soon be an extremely happy musician. So let's get to it. We're gonna kick it off with some gear that's gonna be a guaranteed hit with any musician, no matter the instrument they play or the role in the band or anything like that, DJs, producers, guitarists, anyone is gonna be able to use and appreciate these gifts. And we're gonna start it off with potentially the most important one of all the things that are gonna make someone's music sound better. Probably the most important is gonna be how the musician is hearing what they're playing and recording. And that's why the first thing on our list is gonna be a great pair of Pro Studio headphones. What I have here are the Austrian Audio High X55 Studio headphones. These go for 329. These days, pretty much everyone is playing and recording music on their computer. And especially now when it's not really possible to go out and jam with other people, it's way more important to be able to accurately hear the kind of music that you're making. And that's why you need something like this, a Pro Studio headphone, rather than like the kinds of headphones you would use to listen to music for pleasure, like Beats or AirPods, those have very hyped lows and highs, which means you're not really getting an accurate picture of what it actually sounds like. And the Austrian Audio High x 55s and High x 50s are gonna give you a much more accurate reproduction of the sounds that you're making. The reason that I'm putting the High x 55 and its more affordable younger sibling, the High x 50 on the list is because I found that Austrian Audio had the best price to quality ratio and they're incredibly comfortable. Like look at how much squishy stuff is on it. It's so squishy. It's very important to have very comfortable headphones because as a musician, you're gonna be wearing them for long hours. It's not just like when you throw on your beats and you go for a run, you only have to wear them for an hour or whatever. If you're producing music, writing and recording, you're gonna be wearing them maybe four, five, six hours at a time. And if they're not really comfortable and very padded, and sound really good, then you're just gonna have a bad time. The Austrian Audio High X55s retail for 329 and the X50s are 249 and either one is going to guarantee you a great big smile for any musician that you get them for. They are an investment in their most important assets, their hearing. Speaking of recording on a computer, if this is something that you're intending on doing, you're gonna need a device to get the sound both into and out of your computer. That's called an audio interface, and I have one right here. This is my favorite one. It's called the Apollo Solo from Universal Audio, and this is for sure the most high-quality, compact interface that I have used to date. It's my favorite for a number of different reasons, but not the least of which is that it's actually powered by either Thunderbolt or USB-C, depending on what kind of a computer you have. And what that means is that you don't have to plug in a separate power supply for this. You can plug it straight into the computer and it'll power it off the same cable that it's using to transmit the information. There's a direct input jack on the front where you can plug your guitar or bass straight in and record using AmpSim software. There's a headphone jack where you can plug in your brand new Hi X 55s from Austrian Audio. And then on the back, we've got two combo jacks, which are either XLR or line in. So you can plug in a microphone or like a keyboard with a quarter inch jack. And then we've got two outputs where you can plug in your studio monitors. This is gonna allow you to record two inputs at once and also to control the output level of your headphones and your studio monitors. The Universal Audio Apollo Solo retails for $4.99, comes in two different versions, USB-C and Thunderbolt, and is the perfect interface for any small home studio. Another major advantage of making music in the computer age is having access to a vast number of in-the-box sounds via sample libraries, such as this Abbey Road 1 from Spitfire Audio, which is one of my very favorites that came out this year. 
at literally hundreds of thousands of dollars a day, being able to record a full professional orchestra is something the average musician will just never get to do. But for a very, very tiny fraction of the price, we can get something that is so close, it's actually kind of ridiculous. What I really love about Abbey Road 1 is that it's extremely easy to get beautiful sounds with minimal effort. The way that it's laid out is incredibly simple. We've got one patch that's just the whole orchestra, The sounds are incredibly rich and super realistic, so it's basically like you have a whole orchestra at your fingertips. The first thing you heard me playing was the high strings. There's also individual different horn sections, trumpets, horns, and low brass. There's also high and low woodwinds, and then percussion, which is the real fun thing. Even better, you don't actually have to be any good at the keyboard to access these sounds because any modern recording software is gonna allow you to program them one note at a time really quickly and easily. However, I do find it to be quite a bit easier and more intuitive to use a good keyboard controller like this one that'll allow you to just plug in via USB and control all of these sounds in real time or enter them one at a time. The one that I'm using here today is the Complete A25 from Native Instruments. I love this one because of the way the keys feel, and it also comes in a 49 key and 61 key version. Spitfire's Abbey Road 1 is just 349 until December 1st when it goes up to 449, so you're definitely gonna wanna jump on that sooner rather than later. Speaking of amazing in-the-box sounds, one thing that every song needs is great drums. But recording real drums is a big hassle, it's very expensive and time-consuming, and especially if you're just trying to write a song, you don't necessarily need to go and spend money at a studio. So what we have to solve that problem is this amazing little piece of software called Easy Drummer 2 by TuneTrack, and what it is is it's a little drum set inside your computer that allows you to play and program amazing sounding drums. Even if you don't know how to play or program your own drums, Easy Drummer 2 comes with a ton of pre-made grooves that you can just drag and drop into your session, like this one. Or this one. It's basically a virtual drummer inside your computer with tons of different sounds and styles for $149. Another big thing that musicians are doing online these days is learning songs, and the main place that they go to do that is YouTube. But the problem with learning a song off of YouTube is that you're constantly having to hit play and stop, rewind, fast forward with your hands. But what if you could do that with your feet? Well, you can if you have the Vidami pedal, which is probably the coolest thing that came out this year in terms of learning music. What the Vidami pedal allows you to do is control YouTube playback functions with your feet so that you can keep your hands on your instrument the whole time. This will allow you to learn songs way, way faster and way easier. It will also allow you to control the speed of the video so that you can slow it down, which makes it even easier to learn and to loop sections of it so that you can play along with it over and over again. The Vidami pedal retails for $149.99 and makes learning songs easier, faster, and way more fun. That covers everything that's gonna be a great gift for any musician. Now let's talk about guitarists. So guitarists are a little bit harder to shop for, but if I know one thing about guitarists, it's that they all love pedals. I mean, how could you not? They're so much fun, you throw it in your signal chain and all of a sudden you've got a completely different sound. It's super easy and really it's hours and hours of entertainment even if you're not playing for anybody but yourself. So I figured I'd show you some of them that are my favorites that are ones that I know any guitarist will appreciate. The first one that we're gonna take a look at was easily my favorite pedal that came out this year. It's called the Black Hole from Eventide and it's a reverb pedal that gives you huge, washy, beautiful ambient reverbs. So what this thing does is it takes your sound from this to this. 
A different preset. So you can add more or less, like if we crank it all the way up. Or like a more reasonable amount. It's a little bit of extra. You can change the size of the reverb room. It's really big. Kind of just keeps going. There are sounds in here that you can really get lost in. very tiny sampling of the huge amount of sounds that you can get out of the black hole from Eventide. I absolutely love this pedal. It's probably the most fun I've had with a pedal in a really long time. The black hole from Eventide could be your guitarist's reverb playground for just $279. While the black hole pedal was all about big, beautiful, ambient reverb sounds, the next pedal is all about rock and roll. The Rev G2 is one of my all-time favorite overdrive pedals, and now you can get it in gold. How luxurious. And it sounds amazing. So here's the sound of my guitar without the pedal on. Now we add the G2. So much better. That's what the gain only at half. So let's crank it up a bit more. Take it up all the way. Pedal actually has three different modes. There's the red and blue modes with even more gain. Go to the red channel. So awesome. The incredibly sick Rev G2 Overdrive pedal is normally $229, but through December 8th, if you buy it on Sweetwater, it's only $195. The thing about giving a guitar player a new pedal, though, is kind of like when you give a mouse a cookie, you're gonna have to give them another cable so that they can plug it in, so be sure to pick one of those up, too. Like I said, guitarists love pedals, but not all pedals are effect pedals. Some pedals are all about controlling the effects that you already have just like this Blackstar Live Logic USB MIDI controller. This is a foot switch that you can use not just to control your physical pedal effects and amps, but it can also be used to control your amps and effects in your recording software. For example, I've pulled up the Neural DSP Corey Wong plugin, which is an amp and effects simulator. Got a bunch of different amp sounds and a bunch of different effects pedals. And what we're gonna do is use Live Logic to switch between the presets in real time. Here on the first foot switch, we've got a nice clean tone going on. And now we want a little bit of gain, so we're gonna go to channel two where I've set up a nice crunchy sound. Then we want some lead sound. bit of funky wah sound, cause why not? All with 
one button push each time. Of course, naturally, this is a foot switch, so you'd be controlling it with your feet. I'm just showing you with my hands to give you the idea so that this can be in the shot. The super compact and powerful Blackstar Live Logic foot switch can control pretty much anything that will accept MIDI information, either through the regular old 5-pin MIDI or through USB MIDI, which gives you a gateway into controlling pretty much anything digital at all. And it's $179.99. I love this thing a lot. Sometimes the coolest pieces of gear are the smallest and don't make any sound at all. This year I discovered something that is so tiny and awesome that I've been installing it on a ton of my guitars. It's called the switch lock and it doesn't really look like much of anything at all. But once I show you what it does, you'll be like, oh, that's so cool. It's also for sure the least expensive thing on our list. So if you don't have a ton of money to spend on a gift for your guitarist, I can pretty much guarantee that they are not already going to have one of these. So even though you're not gonna spend a lot of money, it's gonna make a pretty big impact as a gift. So I'm gonna show you right now what it does and what it's for. So this right here is a guitar's pickup selector switch. It switches between which of these pickups is actually engaged and it gives you a bunch of different sounds. The problem that has plagued guitarists for millennia is that it's located in a place where you hit it by accident a lot, okay? So along comes the switch lock which takes basically zero time to install. And it solves this problem by giving you the option of locking it into place. Check out how fast it is to install the switch lock. That's it, you're done. So now you can see how the switch lock works. It's pretty much an on-off switch for your guitar's pickup selector. You can lock it into place and then it's not gonna move anywhere. It's gonna stay on the selection that you had it on until you take it off just by moving it out of the way and then it'll function normally. And you can lock it into any of the positions and it's not going anywhere no matter how hard you biff it. I wanna know how nobody thought of this before. It's so simple and so effective Pretty much every guitar should have this on it. Depending on the style, the switch lock will only set you back between $11 and $14 a piece. Comes in three different colors, clear, black, and white, and will fit either a Strat or Tele style guitar. It's been said that the most precious gift of all is the gift of knowledge. And it's one that you can give your favorite guitar player on your list this holiday season by enrolling them in my Relationships Guitar Scales course. This is a course that I've been teaching for a very long time and it's gonna allow them to learn every single scale on the guitar in just 60 minutes. This is a course that I developed over many, many years of teaching private guitar lessons and it is by far the fastest and easiest way to learn your scales without any rote memorization or music theory. I've had thousands of satisfied guitar players enroll in my course and if you don't like it, I'll give you your money back. So. Really, what do you have to lose except for an hour? And I'd really love to see you over there. Every guitar player needs to store their guitars somewhere. But wouldn't you rather store them in the future? Seriously though, how slick is this thing? It looks like it got sent back in time through a wormhole. And with a name like Quantum Industries, I wouldn't really be that surprised. This is the GTX 01 Pro Touring Edition from Quantum Industries, and this is the future of guitar cases. It is absolutely slick, three guitar case. It has four TSA combination locks on it, six total clasps keeping it shut. So you can see, keeps your guitars so very snug in there. And then also has these little wraps to keep them from going anywhere. This guitar right here is my longest guitar at 27 inches plus a super long inline headstock. And so if you've got like baritone longer scale guitars, you can rest assured that they will fit in there just fine because this is a, this is a pretty big guitar. It goes in no problem. The thing that you wanna look for in a guitar boat like this is a combination of it being super lightweight and also really strong because you want it to protect your instruments, but you don't want it to weigh so much that you're gonna go over your baggage allowance and get charged when you fly with it. I think the GTX-01 does a bang up job of both of those things with the added bonus that it is super sexy and futuristic looking so that you can tour and store your guitars in style. It also comes with a bunch of heavy duty desiccant packets and a dedicated little pouch for them so that you can keep your case a super dry environment for your guitars. It also has this built-in 
Velcro pouch that you can store your cables and accessories in. The GTX-01 is for sure the slickest way to store and display your guitars, and then when it comes time to tour again, you just pop the lid back on, and you have an incredibly lightweight and sturdy case that you can take your axes around the world in. The GTX-01 Pro Touring Edition makes a great gift for $599.99 direct from Quantum Industries. Thanks so much for watching, guys. Hopefully this helps you to find a gift that's gonna make some musician extremely happy. Remember that there are links to where you can buy all of the stuff that we talked about today in the description below. And have a great holiday season, and I'll see you next year.